Hi guys, I'm back. Uh, had a um, some technical difficulties. My signal was out. Hopefully it won't happen again. Anyway, I was saying I'm just getting ready for the pool, going to the pool, taking the kids to the pool with the, their friend. I just wanted to come on here and show you my look. It's very going to be very neutral. And to kind of test, test this makeup out because I haven't tested it in the pool yet and I hear that you can wear this stuff in the pool. And it will not budge. So I went ahead and primed my face, did my eyebrows. Hey Meredith. Uh, did my eyebrows and now I'm just getting um, prepping my eyes. So I'm took taking my concealer and artist brush and I'm actually putting concealer on my eyelids today. Kind of even out the color here. And it's going to be in my eye primer. for my colors to put on. All right, get that under there. All right, like I said, this is gonna be a neutral day and kinda going with a little, uh, a peachy lip. So I'm using palette one, which was our brow, it's the browns, and I'm using a laid it all over my eyelid. And this is, it's a matte color. So it's, it's kind of a, a matte skin color. I'm just going to press it right on top of that concealer that I just did. That's also going to help, help keep that concealer in place without it going anywhere. So yeah, this is going to be interesting. I've only taken the kids to the pool <laughs> once, <laughs> all four. And that was last year, because I have two of them, well, technically three of them still in, can't swim, or they're not tall enough, so they kind of hang on, on with me, but I had little life vests for them. So it should be fun and interesting. My Friday fun day. Alright, I'm going to take Chipper, which is the lighter brown, and my crease brush. And just draw in the seven. So yeah, the kids have been super excited, have been dying to go to the pool. So, like I was saying, before my light went off, or the first time I tried to get on, we're going to try to take them to the pool, and we're gonna come, I'm going to come back later on and kind of talk about if the makeup stayed or not. So this should be, this should be fun and exciting. I always wanted to test this, but I've been dreading taking the kids to the pool by myself. And we don't have a splash pad, splash pad in the neighborhood. We just have a pool, a neighborhood pool. So this should be interesting. I just put um, Sincere as a highlight under my brow with a sponge brush. And now I'm just taking the deluxe brush and just softening those edges out. Always going up. Hello, everyone. Hello. Does anyone have any plans this weekend? I think we're gonna be barbecuing. We always barbecue. We're Texas. We're Texans. We gotta barbecue. Gotta have barbecue. Okay. Now for an eyeliner. I'm using proper. It's a chocolate brown. Whoop. See? Darker ones. And just. Yeah. Now these are definitely supposed to be smudge proof and waterproof. So like I said, we're going to be doing lots of testing out today at the pool. So I did proper. What I love to do is I love to get the liner side of my liner shader brush and pick up a uh, forthright which is, you know, closest to that color, and going over the eyeliner real quick, 
because it has a 30 to 40 second drying time and just kind of smoothing it out so there's not too many harsh lines because I'm going it's neutral I'm trying to be not so harsh okay let's do the other side Alright guys, I'm trying to concentrate. Smooth it out. Boom. Easy neutral. Super easy. Just use two colors. Elated and fourth word. Well, three. And sincere. If you want to bring that highlight but you can definitely leave that out I like a little highlight under my eyebrows okay next off is mascara now our this mascara the 3d fiber lashes mascara is water resistance meaning that it will resist the water but I can definitely if I mess up I can just wipe it off and redo it without it being a huge mess and it's also not going to it's not going to budge even if I get water splashed on my face that's like one of the things I'm going to test out is testing out is it really going to because I hear like all my other friends have tried it out I have not personally tried it out so I gotta try it out I gotta test things out my own self you know And I don't go to the, I don't go out to the pool very often to be able to try it out. So that's what we're gonna do today. And that's like what I love. And it's like it's not only the mascara that's water resistant. It's also our. Like I was saying earlier, our eyeliners and lip liners, they're they are waterproof, they're smudge proof, they're just not going to go on. If I'm going to cry my eyes out from watching a movie or just something, I get emotional, I can cry and not have to worry about anything draining, getting like, you know, it, it going down, streaming down, running down my face. Get the other eye. One of these days, you know, it'll be fun to try to put your makeup on with the hand. You're not your dominant hand. We'll try that one day. That should be fun. And I'll have the kids here to see. I just want to see their reactions when I do it. Maybe we'll do that one day. It'll be awesome with lives. We could just fast forward through the boring stuff, like putting on mascara. Hello, Lindsay. Just getting ready for the pool. poked my eye. <laughs> mm, wow. Really poked my eye. <laughs> See, it's tearing up already. <laughs> All right. Ugh.
And this is why I put my foundation on after I do my eyes. Just in case I poke my eye out and I have to wipe the tear away. <laughs> okay, next is the foundation. Of course, of course, liquid. Liquid foundation, my favorite. Three drops on the brush. Now this may not, this may look crazy, but it's going to cover my entire face. Trust me. And just little circles buff that all in because why because it has little optical diffusers in them to give us that flawless finish Alright, concealer. Because again, I don't get sleep because I'm, I'm a mom. Hashtag mom life. Oh my gosh, that reminds me. I have a story to tell you. And it was, it was during the 4th of July. And just, Therese just woke up one day, you know, that day. And was just like, hashtag America's great. And we're just like, where did this come from? Because <laughs> I know like there's a, a Jimmy a Jimmy Fallon and Justin Timberlake skit where it's all just like hashtag. They're just hashtagging everything. And I was like looking to my husband. I was just like, she has never seen that before. Where did this come from? And it was just like all day that day. She's like, hashtag America's great. We're just like, oh, this child. What are we going to do with you? You're so hilarious. It's like she's she's like got millennial speak, but she's not a millennial. Who knows? That may carry off into her generation. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Oh. So I'm putting the concealer because it's going to help hide my bags, help bring down that focus. From there, and also to help clean up my makeup line. This should be in everybody's drawer. Every mom's drawer should have concealer. Stuff is amazing. Clean up. I'm going back with my liquid foundation brush just to smooth out those lines. You can also do this with a blending bud. Just get it moist, get it wet, and just pat it on. I don't have a blending bud, so I find this to work just as well. Try not to erase your eyeliner there. 
Like I say, it's concealer. It's gonna do that. Bronzer time. Love and bronzer. Who would have thought bronzer would be life for the summertime? For any time, really, but the summertime. Just awesome stuff. Awesome, awesome. This one just sweeping up on my cheek today. And it's, I love this because it doesn't turn you orange. There, do I look orange? No, it's brown. It's supposed to give that, what it's supposed to do, that summer glow. Not an orange glow, not looking like an Oompa Loompa. And that's great about this bronzer. Love, love, love it. I've seen many people use other bronzers and they just, they're just orange. It just doesn't look great. But this stuff is awesome. Now I'm going to put some, the corners right here in my forehead. Since my hair is up. Alright. Okay. Ooh, my foot is falling asleep. <laughs> Okay, so my lip look that I'm going with is not super bold, although, you know, if you're going with the neutral look, you kind of want to make your lips a little bolder, but it's, it's, it's a summer bold, I think. It's a good summer one, and I'm going to be using just um, a lip liner on top of uh, putting the lip balm bon on, just so I can have a little bit of moisture and hydration going on while I'm out in the, um, in the sun, out swimming in the pool, so... This is, uh, the lip liner is peachy. It's kind of an orange color. See, super pretty. It reminds me of, it doesn't remind me of summer. Peaches remind me of summer. So this, I'm just gonna put it on. All over my lip. Excuse me. I'm going to need to sharpen this after I'm done. It's peachy. Kind of has a shimmer to it too. I didn't realize that because I haven't used this on my all over my lips. Yep, I've used it as a liner to go with my liquid lipstick in Soulful, which is like a, a pink coral pink color. Yeah, I've never used it all over my lip. I never realized that it has a shimmer to it. Mash it, mash it. And the same with with the, our, our eyeliners, same with our lip liners. They have a 30 to 40 second drying period. And then they're done. They don't move. Alright, top that off with my lip balm balm. And there we got it. My lip color to go with my neutral eyes. All right, taking my kids to the pool. I will be back on later, probably, oh, I don't know, maybe after we get back from the pool and give you my review of how 
um, the makeup was when it got wet, if it budged, or if I noticed any kind of movement. So I can't, can't wait to tell you guys. Alright, heading off. See y'all.